If time travel is possible, you just won't be able to change the past when you get there. The science behind this can be illustrated by reducing the problem to the simplest situation you can think of. For example, balls on a pool table. Let's set up a pool table that's like a time machine. If a ball enters one pocket, it travels through a wormhole and can exit another pocket before it entered the first pocket. So it's a time machine. So now suppose the ball really does go through the first pocket, emerges before it entered, and then hits itself before it entered the first pocket. That would deflect it, preventing it from entering the first pocket, and thus preventing it from having exited the second pocket and done the deflection in the first place. So it's a paradox.